Cover your head with a wide-brimmed hat and your mouth, neck, and nose with a bandana. If your job is to apply pesticides, wear protective eyewear. Follow the label on the product you are using to see what kind of personal protective equipment is required. If possible, avoid wearing contact lenses when handling pesticides. Select unlined closed toe waterproof boots that reach at least halfway to the knee. No sandals and no tennis shoes. To protect your skin, always wear long sleeve shirts, pants, and gloves. Sensitive areas to be especially aware of are your groin, your ankles, your neck, behind your ears, and any other place where your skin is thin or exposed. When you get dressed in the morning, make sure there is no gap between your pants and your shirt, no matter what standing, sitting, or bending position you might have to be in that day. If you are pregnant, you should avoid working in fields where pesticides have been recently applied. If you have to work in the fields, be doubly sure to wear the proper protective clothing and equipment to reduce exposure for yourself and your unborn baby. Wash your hands after working in the fields whether or not you are wearing gloves. Use plenty of soap and water and dry your hands on disposable towels. Do this before and after you go to the restroom and before you eat, smoke, or chew gum. When handling pesticides, or if you are in the area of a pesticide application, avoid inhaling the pesticide spray. Cover your mouth and nose and be mindful of the direction of the wind. To avoid putting your family at risk of pesticide exposure from your shoes or clothes, Remove them immediately upon arriving home and take a shower. Shampoo your hair and bathe with plenty of water and soap. Also, make sure you wash your work clothes separately from the household laundry. If you see pesticides being applied anywhere near your home, bring your children, pets, and if possible, the laundry inside and close the windows. Stay inside for the duration of the spraying and do not turn on the AC.